Hey babe, I'm sorry, I was wrong. Okay, I can do this. So when are you gonna apologize for stop being a little bitch? And I'll give your grandma back her dentures. I said, unblock me and I'll give your grandma back her dentures. You want the bitch to eat, right? I'm black. I left them. Daddy left you. That's why you I left them. Left. Be no, for you. real. I left them. They left you. They left you. I'm never washing this hand again. <laughs> I didn't catch your name. And surname. So I'd be Katie Smith. I just got goosebumps. Do you mind if I call you my king? Because I don't ever want to see that crown fall. So when's the wedding? <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. So we, so we. Uh, no, but I do think it could be beneficial to start discussing dates. Get the ball rolling a little bit. <laughs> I think March. Look what this girl Malice posted. I agree. If a man's height chart looks like this, 5'2 to 5'5, five five, he's a child. 5'5 five five to 5'7, five he's a young boy. And then 5'7 uh, five to 5'11, five young man, six foot a king. A woman's chart should look like this. 90 to 120 pounds, goddess. 130 to 160, a queen. 170 to 200, a man. Ah, a man is, ah, I'm dead. 200 plus, boo. Oh my God, 100. Ah. Oh, she's funny. You know what I find crazy? I think a lot of women put too much pressure on men. You guys wear fajas, you wear push-up bras, you have all these things to enhance your- If I was obese, that makes me unmarried and not high value just because I'm overweight. If your boyfriend was to cheat on you with a fat woman, how would that make you feel? Oh, that would hurt my feelings. That would hurt your feelings, right? Yeah. Not even just the cheating itself, but the fact that it's a fat woman. <laughs> oh. <laughs> women engage in intersexual competition too so one of the things women will shame other women for is being fat women call each other whores they talk about how old they are and they talk about being fat so you know that being fat is not inherently desirable to men you would feel more offended if your guy cheated on you with a fat woman because you'd be like really the bitch is fat <laughs> What's your biggest turnoff in guys? Probably when they don't work out, go to oh, the really? and stuff. So what do you guys prefer in a guy? Really rich, really black, at least 6'5". 6'5"? Yeah. Lots of money, really. Yeah. Like a, a yacht and stuff? Yeah, yeah. That kind of thing. Um, you can buy me fancy things, take me on trips, pay my rent. Between men or women, who has a harder life? Absolutely women. Why? We bleed for a uh, week a month. We are f***ing... We're sexualized everywhere we go. Yeah, get like cat called? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. The parking lot tenant tried to steal me before. Not me. Anyone tried to steal <laughs> you today? We can. Know my value, I know my worth, and I know my beauty, and that is appreciated by other people because beauty is subjective. My fatness doesn't devalue me. Why? So I'm an A. Why? I have been pursued by many men who think I am gorgeous and beautiful. That perception exists whether you have it or not. So well, guess what? I'll never be the, the only one who thinks I'm hot, and I know that bugs the yeah, shit out of you. But if I have the value judgment of hundreds of millions of people to compare the standard to and i know that i'm below that threshold and just decide that i'm above that threshold anyway i'm not the only that's person not based who makes on that anything decision. objective you're just making up. and what societal standards in which country i must in every country on planet earth she's not an eight but, it's ridiculous yeah. to be fair also it's interesting to claim to be so religious and so close to jesus mm -hmm. and be so negative to tell the truth no, i'm just saying just to be so what negative. would jesus do he'd he be like you're a 10 he sweetheart 
What do you really rate yourself, though? Like, not. Oh, I'm not. I'm not anything special. Maybe a six. Maybe twenty I think years you guys ago. Have lack of confidence. No, it's uh, just being realistic. I'm dating celebrities, I mean, that's, billionaires, real, millionaires. I, for me, being a bit literally, of- and a lot of guys don't want to admit that they like fat girls because of guys like you, where you would turn around and look at your friend and be like, "Oh, I can't believe you like that whale," and then he feels really unconfident no, and then goes to my page on OnlyFans and spends eight hundred dollars to collect my content. I've been in Vogue. You can go see my face in Nordstrom's Ulta Beauty. Most of the dudes who are running around with fat chicks are ugly dudes. Oof. Most of them. Most men would prefer their women to not be showing off their bodies 24-7. How do you know that? Can and I see like, the statistics? Like, yeah, so like, we want evidence. But, but we want proof. Is, this is your opinion. Can you at least concede that most men don't want to date a sex worker? No. Because like, I have um, 150,000 followers and I know most of them would love that, to date me. If you think most men jerking off to you would want to date you, why is this man cheating on his wife with you and not dating you instead of breaking up with his wife? I wouldn't want that because that would be a lot of responsibility for me and I don't want to be tied down to any one person. So then you must acknowledge that these men don't want to date you, they just want to you or jerk off to you. I mean, no, because I think a lot of them do want to date me the way they talk to me on OnlyFans. Yeah, but that's not real. You don't care about them in a way and all they want you to do is pop your I've had customers pick me up from my house and like go on dates Because they want to you. Where's the ring? There's no ring. Exactly. I'm in my 60s. People think that no one looks at you anymore. And the truth of the matter is, I have just as many people who want to sleep with me now as mm. I ever mm. did. <laughs> there isn't that thing when you walk in the room that every guy goes, ooh, because you're not as easy as you were when you were young. And men recognize that's why they don't look at you as much. It's not because you're not as hot. My you're not as isn't. easy to... Oh, yeah and you're not as easy to get rid of, and you're not as easy to keep quiet, you're not as easy to dump afterwards, you're not as easy to be a side piece. It's not that you're not as hot, you're hotter, hotter. Mm. Because you're more relaxed, you're less concerned about, do I look great? You know you look great. It's not because you're not as anything, it's just because you're not as easy. Oh, easy prey. This comment was on my post about men saying that women after 35 are invisible. <laughs> Look at that. Me being, that was just me being hit up by some. What these men don't understand is when I get on a dating site, I have so many options, even at 43. So, but these men don't. It's harder and harder for them to get laid as they get older and older. And it's just as easy for me to get laid at 42 or sorry 43 i just had a birthday the as it was when i was in my fur ends you know why because men are really easy it doesn't matter if they're young it doesn't matter if they're old i can score a younger dude so much faster than any older man and i just i don't understand their mentality so these older dudes who are my age and older, um, they don't realize that us women who are 40 in our 40s and 50s as well can still screw 20 year olds if we want to. The thing is, we just we don't want to.